Hi guys, this is Eva Kitchen and you welcome to my YouTube channel. So guys, today we'll be doing 10 goofy questions. Oh my god, 10 goofy questions. You know what that means? That means I'll be answering some kind of freaky weird questions. <laughs> Ain't that funny? <laughs> okay, guys. D guess what? Yeah, it's ten goofy questions. Don't laugh at it, but it's so going to be interesting. And I try to make it real, like real as possible, like real as shit. So let's dive into it. Let's get into it. <laughs> like, are you kidding me? You are fried in front of my spouse, like my husband. Jesus Christ, Lord. Many times now. Nah. Ah, why you want change? Many times, as in anywhere, anywhere, inside the house, outside the house, occasion, bedroom, kitchen, toilet, car, anywhere. Anywhere where you ugly, you drop and get. It's a natural phenomenon. I've been a phenomenon. I've been a phenomenon. Eh? It's a natural curse. What are you trying to do with me? What are you trying to do to me? Any way where you don't give me, any way where you want to take combat, you release it. Some said it's gas, some said it's anointing. Now you can't know the interpretation that you give it, that is what it is. For me, it is my new to the F. Let's fertilize. Next question. <laughs> Just trying to think. I don't think I've made that in the park. Like at the park, I've not made that up in the car. Um, I think the weirdest place would be the kitchen. Yeah, the kitchen. Oh, that one is a weird question. So <laughs> it deserves a weird answer. Yeah, yeah. My my weirdest place I've ever made out is probably in the kitchen that one I can remember for sure mm. I don't want to go into details please don't even ask me I don't come from me and because I am holy wedge I don't do pack I don't do car I only do inside the house you know what I'm saying <laughs> so yeah it's in the kitchen I probably possibly 100% in the living room but that one is it's not a weird place is it no it's not it's still in the house so kitchen and in the living room next question love this question die like i love it i love it i love it that like, best part of my body i have a lot part of my body that i love so much i have a whole lot first of all my eyes mm -hmm. i love my eyes so i have two that i that you cannot tell me to choose one no my eyes and my legs yes my eyes and my legs like i have a very nice straight you know hairless legs so i love it i love to flaunt my legs people that follow me on my social media status and all that they know what's up i flaunt i flaunt my legs and then my eyes because while i was growing up i was you know kind of bullied because i have a body eyes but because i didn't know what it takes to have these eyes now i grew up and then my husband oh my god he all the time is like baby i love your eyes so now i can roll my eyes like Mm -hmm. next question please <laughs> that's how i love my eyes i love my eyes and my legs yeah those are my best part of my body that but that does not mean i don't like every other part i love every other part but these two places i just called top notch for me next question who initiates this who want to initiate them before not me ah you know what they're hungry huh? I pray me. <laughs> you know about the hungry. Huh? We would just be like that. We would just die our day. <laughs> I declare you. We would just die our day. Ah, last, last. He is the one. He is the one. 95% is the one. Ah, that area. No go there. No carry and play with them. <laughs> I can stay months safe, you know, shaking everywhere. 
I go just day. But you know fit now, nah. you know fit. You understand? So he's the one that initiates. <laughs> Tell you, what your day? Ah, to your tent to Israel. What your day? Nothing. Everywhere go your clear. Everywhere go the da. Now what for you? I bet next question. <laughs> Honestly, to be serious, he's the one that does it <laughs> because I'm not a sense freak. So he initiates nine five percent of the time that I do it is maybe because we are having some misunderstanding or some arguments and all that. And probably I've thought about it and I feel like yes, I am at fault. So for me to make things up and make things right, you know, I go for it. You know, just sort of like do the makeup and break up stuff. You know, the breakup and makeup stuff. So yeah, other than that, Naim. Next question. Oh my god my most embarrassing moment jesus lord i can't even remember of the past but i'll take the recent one that, that just happened to me like on the 10th of this august 2020 as my most embarrassing moment so guys we went to do some um you know photo shoot for i and my baby and like a family photo shoot on my baby's one year birthday and i was in my time okay Little did I know that, you know, I just got carried away, you know, the overwhelming thing and um, I, I was just carried away and before you know it, I was fully soaked and drained and, you know, stained like It was completely a mess like a I was practically embarrassed I was confused restless everything mixed together even to the point that me that is a photo freak a picture freak I did not even get any personal pictures from the photographer that's how bad you can know you can tell that that was so embarrassing for me and I lost focus on that photo shoot day a lot of things that I, I wanted that did not fall in place but you know only God knows why things like that happen but yeah that is certainly my my that is certainly my most embarrassing moment that I can actually remember now next question <laughs> guys I know you kind of wonder why she have having a cap and her glasses on because I want to die Porsche <laughs> oh yes I want to die Porsche I want to die slaying like I want to die without sickness without stressing anybody and when i'm above 100 years that is when i want to die like 110 upwards god can take me without sickness or stressing my family member but mama mia we gonna slay until that year come <laughs> so yeah don't ask me that kind of question because i'll be dying porsche like i'll be dying the designer death god have mercy and I do not want to, I, do, I don't want my soul to belong to, to be found missing on that day, God, as I'm filming, I am praying, God, I beg, I beg. I don't want, may they find this soul for your kingdom. I want to be dead, ba, ba, ba. But guys, guess what? I'll be dying posh, like slaying, like uh, uh, no good deal. Don't try me. Like you see, that is why I'm just wearing my heart, my cap and my glasses. So yeah, next question. You wake up, flawless, na na, flawless, na na, na. This diamond, flawless, my diamond, flawless. This rock, flawless, my rock. I woke up like this, hey. I woke up like this, hey, hey, hey. We flawless, ladies. Tell them I woke up like this. Hmm? I woke up like this. We flawless, ladies. Tell them say yeah. Look so good tonight. God and God and say I look so good tonight. God and God and God I. <laughs> you will know Beyonce is my favorite. So that flawless, oh girl. When you're waking up and you're flaunting yourself, you know anyhow you see yourself, be happy, be grateful. Another song I love is Osha Boo. There's always that one person that will always have your heart. You'll never see him coming cause you you, cause you're blinded from the sun. Yeah, no, 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 one for you, play for everyone to see. Ooh, baby. Ooh. Yeah, nah. mm. 
Mm. Don't know about you, but I know about us. And uh, it's the only way we know how to rap. I love these two songs. Joke apart, I don't play. I play these songs every day, like literally every day. So, guys, these are my favorite songs. Next question. <laughs> I'm just thinking, uh, let me say, in my marriage, I've, I spend a lot on my husband, like I spoil my man. And I think it's something crazy one should do while you're in love or why you, uh, you know, why you fancy whoever you love. So yeah, the craziest thing I could possibly place my mind or my head on right now is spending extensively on my man, like, oh my gosh. And he's so expensive like my husband is not me i can just be going to some corner corner shops you know not like cheap shops but to compare his own taste is a no way and then for me to treat him and get him satisfied i need to beat that class i need to be there i need to shop and do spoil him you know that is i i can i can bleed my card my account drive for him I do it all the time. I, I could sponsor a trip, be it any part of the country, I might just treat him to that trip. We could go shopping, I could foot the bills, you know, do something crazy. And this is one thing we may forget to understand that in as much as you want your man to spoil you, your man also wants to be spoiled. You need to treat him right. You want something from him. Are you ready to give him something? Gone are the days you're like folding your hands, waiting for the man to give you money before you cook soon, before you be able to cook. You can just treat him to his best meal. That is crazily loving him. You know, it's, it doesn't boil down to the X E X. You know, you know what I'm saying? So treat your man the way you want to be treated. If you want some expensive fucking gift? Do it. Do it. Work hard and earn it and spoil your man. So yeah, I think I do, I know for sure that I do it a lot for him. And he's my ride and die, even though he's so expensive. Next question, I beg. <laughs> Why? It didn't work. We're not compatible. We are obviously not compatible. Sorry guys, I'm in the park. So we are not compatible. That's why it did not work. No two ways about it. And there's... Does it say my husband says like the um, one door needs to be closed, like one door needs to shut for another one to help it open? So that door was practically shut, and then the God now opened this door that made me see my husband and we got married and we're still living together. So that's it, it did not work. Hmm. Some of the seven are weary, weary. I bet more no good idea, Jerry. I bet next question. My girl, when last I washed my hair, nah. <laughs> oh god, this one had go. I can't remember. I cannot remember. Let me know. Lie. I cannot remember. Probably not this year. Yes. Is it your hair next? Is it your? Is it your own? Uh, let it be. I know. Let it be. <laughs> yes, that's because I don't even basically wear hair nets to sleep these days. I just mat my hair cornrows all back and that's it. So I don't remember my hair net except I'm on an extension, like a fixed in extension like this one. That is where I put on hair net. But other than that, since this year, this is my first week um, fixed in I'm wearing. Others has been weak. So yeah, that's the reason. But it is not a good behavior. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. But yeah, I have to be real. I've not washed my hair net since this year. So guys, that's it. So guys, that brings us to the end of our 10 goofy questions. How did I do? Rate me over 10. Rate me, rate me, rate me. I rate myself 9. I rate myself 9 that I tried. So give me your ratings. Thank you so much for sticking wow. around. Thank you for watching me. Do what to leave me your comment. And if you so want to, you know, join in these goofy questions, yeah, feel free to do your video. Feel free to copy out the questions and shoot your video. Let's see how goofy you can be with your questions. <laughs> so yeah, I'm challenging APJ Plus family, Lolo and Kechi, and simply show me to these 10 goofy questions. Yeah, the questions are same, so don't worry. The questions are the same, but obviously your challenge. So give us your 10 goofy answers to these 10 goofy questions. 
thank you guys so much and i remain your lawyer saver kitchen until next time bye bye let me go and enjoy the weather the weather is so fun today yeah let's go and enjoy the weather so take care of yourselves lovey and stay safe peace out